Welcome to Fallout 76, this is Jim. In this video, we're going to continue on our exploration of Skyline Valley region, which is a very unique area. It's the new map expansion. Now, this is part four. You can check out the other three parts in a little playlist that I have. It's a pretty good little area. Uh, so what I've been doing is we started up here at part one. We made our way down to south a little bit and then we were working our way from east to west and west to east type grid pattern. And uh, we found some unmarked locations. We come across some brand new enemies to the game. Uh, the only exception to that is of course the Dark Hollow Manor. Uh, for some reason this icon did not pop up for us yet and I don't know why that is. Uh, so if you remember the last episode we found ourselves here to the trading post. Now I do want to add that uh, enemies can spawn here because uh, this is my fourth attempt. And after the third attempt I was being attacked by the lost. I don't know where they came from they just kind of came out of nowhere. And I kind of fought them off. I was going to keep the video, but I thought, you know what, that's a uh, kind of hard start there. So I just wanted to let you know that they will spawn here. They're, you know, even though we think it might be like a green area, but it's not. They will spawn in here. <laughs> okay, I, f I find this place something similar to Nuka World on Tour. You know what I mean? They have all kinds of these, uh, you know, they have the ammo box. They have the legendary exchange machine, punch card machine. They have all the workbenches. Uh, it's a pretty cool little place. Pretty cool. Uh, so what we're going to do here is we are going to continue on uh, west and towards the marker. And then we're going to go down and then make way across. So I'm thinking maybe two more episodes, I'm thinking. All depends on what we run into. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, it's a pretty good time. It's definitely, I really like the uh, the area. It can be a little dark, I find. Because they have that fogginess kind of look to the area. And uh, sometimes it can be a little hard to see. But we're going to get going here. All right. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of my little... This little gameplay uh, of course we're not doing any events we're not picking up any notes or anything this is just purely exploration and then once we're done this little series then we'll go into oh we got some deadly wolves over there then we're gonna go into maybe do some quests and and such what's this guy here scorch windigo oh wow don't come across those very often got him Deadly Wolf. Nice. Another Deadly Wolf. I find the enemies here are a little beefy. Even if they're level 50, I find they're beefy. There we go. Nice. And the vegetation. The vegetation is what uh, I find the most. That they Everything is usually kind of still most times in other parts of the game, but it's <laughs> the vegetation moves around quite a bit. I wonder where that Wendigo went. I don't see it anywhere. He <laughs> disappeared. Oh well. But well, we'll keep going. glowing red roach. I find uh, there's a lot of glowing creatures in this part of the region. Uh, Skyline Valley, so, you know, we do get daily weekly challenges where we have to kill a uh, glowing creature, and this is a real good spot. Like, they're just everywhere. So they're definitely not hard to find. Let's take a look here. All right, so that's off in the distance. 
have a little area. Looks like we got a uh, airship here. Bird or bird, whatever you want to call it. That's interesting. Okay, wow. Okay. Uh-oh. Right, row. So that's an assaultron we hear in the background. You see it going there. Special agent. Okay. Uh, what I want to do... What do I want to do? I mean, we have those canisters there. We can... There we go. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Special Agent uh, Saltron. <laughs> Roger that. Take a look around. <laughs> Private uh, Protectron. A little bobblehead there, bobblehead leader. That's kind of cool. Get a terminal. This is quite the little trailer setup. I don't think I've ever uh, never seen this in the game before. They have the little trailers all connected like this. Huh. Not picking anything else up. If we got some fuel tanks here, can we pick these up? We can. That's one thing I mentioned. I uh, I want to mention. There's a lot. Okay, rapid in camp. Okay. Ah, uh, there's a lot of stuff in this game that we cannot pick up. Oh, look at that. We got a sensor module. Two of them. That's pretty awesome. We got some Mr. Handy fuel. That is that we can pick up. That's pretty cool. I'm I'm pretty happy with that. because uh, we can use that for you know collect fuel tanks or uh, scrap junk to produce oil. These uh, fuel tanks here. We got these sensor modules. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is a great spot right down here. Nice. I don't think we can interact with this, can we? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh. Oh, we got a fat man in there. Nice. Vacuum tubes. We got some aluminum scrap. That's pretty awesome. We can pick up. No one of my uh, members, one of my subscribers, had mentioned that uh, there's not a whole lot that we could pick. Like there's a lot available, but we can't pick everything up. And I uh, totally agree. Combat armor helmet there. Oh, we get Mr. Gardner down there. Okay. Let's check out this assault on here. Special agent. Good stuff. It's a level three uh, lock. Okay. There we go. Another level three lock. Wow. Thanks. <laughs> hmm. right, that's pretty cool. Where are we at here? Right there. Rapid in camp. Rapid in camp? I don't know. Probably butchering it. Let's go down here. This gardener. Get him out of the way. Nice. Oh, please protect John. Hi, buds. Protect and serve. Hey, not doing that good of a job. Huh. 
Huh, a little keypad on there. Inaccessible. It's canoes here, nice. Mr. Gardner Supervisor, okay. Oh, we <laughs> destroyed his uh, little friends there. This is. Oh, what was that? I thought I was able to interact with it for a second there. Brown house, okay. Not too sure there's going to be any enemies in here, mind you, but I like that. We got a teapot here, that's cool. We simply can't show wilting flowers at the flower gala. We'll be the laughing stock of the show. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. Cars terminal. We get some goodies in there, looks like. So there's dangerous pastimes popping up, so that's the brand new event right up here. I have yet to do that myself. I might do it uh, kind of separately. And then I'll make a kind of video on it there just so I know uh, what it is we have to do. It's downstairs. That's, uh, there's our terminal there. Remote door control. Okay. The garden always looks splendid this time of year. <laughs> I hope that you're enjoying your stay at Rapidan Camp. All right. A bunch of bottles here. There's no real. What's this here? Brotherhood Recon Rifle Schematics. Okay. That's interesting. Brotherhood Recon Rifle Schematics. So we'll keep that there. We're not too sure if that's part of a quest line, so we'll leave that there. Board game and crystal liquor decanter. Oh, a bunch of other board games here. That's pretty awesome. We can't even pick that one up. Can't pick that one up either, can we? No. Nope. Huh. Who's this guy anyway? Oh, Gumley. Soaking up the garden again, I see. It's Appalachia. Sit upstairs here first. If you notice wilting flowers, then please do let me know. study back here. Cigarette packets. Nice. Oh, we got a little cap stash there. Oh, no. Probably a little You're bathroom, wilting. yeah. Oh, wow. Another teapot. That's cool. We have uh, Tales from the West Virginia we Hills. Okay. Show wilting flowers Looks like it's a flower natural flower. book. We'll be the laughing huh. stock of the show. Interesting. We have a folder. Looks like there's something written on that folder, too. Weird. So we'll, we'll, we'll just leave it as is, because it might have something to do with a quest. So we'll just leave that here for now. We had a plan down there. Technical data. Okay. I hope that you're enjoying your stay at Rapid Got a couple Cap. telephones. That's awesome. Some copper. Uh, cool. Man, let's keep going here. Oh, some more board games up here we can't touch. Can't collect. Okay. FYI on that. Where's that downstairs at? Here, there we go. Huh. Two 
packs of cigarettes. Pretty good spot for cigarettes. Couple packets. Terminal that we can, one terminal we can use. We get some more, another telephone, so that's pretty good. Awesome. Yeah, right on. Oh no! You're wilting! There's a nice little spot there. Alright, let's keep going here. Got a cooking station here, looks like. Yeah. Protect to guard the supervisor. Sir. I don't know if we had to destroy those guys. One on a stick. Eat one of those. Huh. Maybe we can pick up that up there, just a bunch of bottles. kitchen area. Oh, sugar and some spices and some salt. That's pretty awesome. Pretty good spot for spices and sugar, that's for sure. Wow. That's, uh, that's alright. More sugar over here. Nice. Good to know this stuff. Daily, weekly challenges, you know. More board games. Can we pick these up? Oh, we can't pick those guys up. That's good. Uh, more technical data. And a little safe here, nice. It's a level three. Another telephone. Pretty good spot for some telephones. What's this here? Uh, special visit itinerary. Okay. okay. So again, we're not picking stuff up because it might have something to do with a quest. Yeah, I'm thinking we didn't have to destroy those guys. <laughs> oh well, it is what it is, I guess. It's funny how the supervisors in the white, everyone else is uh, red. That's kind of funny. Eggs, fertilizer. Back out there. Lock and load this thing just in case we need it. Plant, fertilize. <laughs> oh. Okay, well. Maybe we do if they kill them. That answers that question. <laughs> that answers that, Jimmy old pal. Get over here. Lunch pail. Let's see what we got under here. Fishies. Not a whole lot. It doesn't hurt the check, right? You can get up out of there. That's that. Pretty good little spot there. Lots of goodies to be had, that's for sure. We'll continue on towards the marker. Make sure that we're on track. Yeah, okay. Oh, we get diseased uh, albino yogawai. Look at my bear. Oh, we get a lost builder over there. Oh, we got a couple of them. These guys are just kind of roaming around. Hey, God, I don't see a curve.
see the two shot. sound like, yeah, you know what they sound like? They sound like Transformers. That's what they sound Oh, Oh, where did you come from? Holy! Oh, we got a welder. And uh, they, like, they like to use rubbers, these guys. Melee weapons. <laughs> Alright, let's keep going. It's not a bad area here. Nice and, uh, Foresty. We got something coming up on the map there. Compass. Deadly glowing ant down there, apparently. Oh, a bunch of them. Holy. Look at them all down there. There's like... It's like six of them at least, anyway. Oh. A little ant colony down there. <laughs> okay, we'll leave those guys alone. Got some little beehive here. Interesting. champion over there. You don't even see me. Yeah, this is a nice part of the uh, Skyline Valley. Bee swarms. Let's take care of these guys. up area. Both well, things coming up on the map. Alright, so we're looking straight ahead, so it looks like there's three of them right in front of us here. walk through there. Let's just ask it for it. Let's walk over here, get on the high ground. Thrasher. I think those guys, those guys are annoying. Like giant <coughs> turkeys. Naked Creek. He's backing up pretty good there. Yeah, these guys are pretty smart. Ow. Where did he come from? Crippled me. All right. Yeah, so right there. Naked Creek. Cool. Check her out. Blue Ridge Guard. Black Cowboy Hat. Sure. Southern route. Up cap. A pheasant. A 
pheasant. Huh. I don't think we have pheasants in the game till now. Pheasant. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, being watched. Another little note here. Being watched. What are these things here? They're like eggs, but we can't interact with them. Get some dumb gumdrops here. So again, eat uh, candy, cake, or pie. Gumdrops are definitely on the list. I don't know if they're going to be there every single time, but it's good to see. A little cooking station here. It's a corpse. Oh, it's a pheasant right there. Look at that. Burp. Chicken thigh. Okay. A pheasant. Well, how about that, guys? That's pretty cool. So I don't know how many uh, I'm going to come across, but again, that's right here at the uh, Naked Creek. Pheasant. Hmm. Oh, there's a little area up here. Let's check this out. Probably binoculars, yeah. Lots of binoculars to be had. Oh, another note right here. Getting worse. We have a little dude back here. Nope, oh, we already saw that. I think. No, we didn't. Black cowboy hat. Leave that for next time. Oh, that's cool. That is cool. Alright, so let's take a look here. Go up here towards the marker. And we see uh, something popped up there. Let's go ahead and check that out. Get another alpha. We'll get some more tr thrashers. Good lord. Yeah, I'm not a fan of these guys. Not a big fan of those guys. And it's usually like two or three of them. up here. Let's get something to drink here. It's like a uh, super mutant MO. Super mutant champion. Let's get rid of this guy down here first. Cultus. It's a cultus down there. Weird. That's so weird. This lone cultist. Huh. Yeah, let's take him out. Oh, it's three of them. Of course there is. I I go to the divine light. I was going to say, there has to be more than just one. Keep going. I 
Let's head up there. Research, site, Saxony. Okay. Right here. No green stuff here. Out there is something. You cannot kill us all. Oh, he's like crouched or something underneath there. Oh, is that over there? That's weird. Ah! You just stay there, buddy. Too, a little too far away from him. So stupid, so weak. Ah, uh, lightning harvester terminal. Okay. Where'd you go? Huh? Out of unlock, level gonna zero requirement. Find. That's good. Gonna, gonna kill you. Yeah, right on, Gabe. Right on. Huh. Got him. Isn't that amazing? I think that is like so cool. Not too much uh, here. Yeah, that guy that's like, he was like stuck under there or something. I don't even know how he got under there. It's just the way he spawned in, I guess. I'll take it. Not just a regular skull, but an upper skull. <laughs> and a ranger hat. It's kind of floating there. Perfect. We go inside that, can we? Those blue screws. Oh, wow, a bunch of uh, like that aluminum canister. More alien blaster rounds, a bunch of meat bags in here. Nice. Came up here already. Yeah. Hey, right, cool. Let's head up there. I don't think there's anything up there, but we'll check it out either way. Oh, it's a big pot. Very right, cool. Getting pretty close. Uh, there's a light or something up here. Let's check that out real quick. house of some sort. Huh. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. This guy. A saddler. That's a nice little tree house right there. We got a little generator. Pickaxe. Nothing up here. It'd be interesting if you could incorporate uh, your camp with this. I don't know if you can or not. Maybe it's too close. But uh, that would be cool if you could incorporate your camp. That in your camp. That would be pretty sharp. Be pretty envious of everyone. <laughs> That's for sure. Yeah. Yeah, sure. 
All right, so we've pretty much made it to our destination. Let's see where we are on the map here, right over here. Okay, so let's uh, head down a little bit. Let's put the marker down to here. And we'll head down a little south. We'll still check the area, see if we see something different. But yeah, a little unmarked location there. You might be able to get away with that, actually. It is fairly uh, decent. You know, a little bit of a grade, but a uh, couple foundations. Yeah. A little fox over there. Yeah, I love the, I love the music in this area. Very nice. Nothing really on the compass showing up on uh, to the south of us, to the west of us either. Oh, did the mole rat over there? Okay, so we do have something a little bit more. Okay, so good stuff. So we made it. Let's put our marker at the far end over here. There we go. So that will pretty much take care along this line. Some sort of mine popping up. There we go. There we got a silver deposit here. That's pretty cool right here. It's a little silver deposit. So we're ready to go, you know. Over oh, here, let's check this out. Oh, boys. <laughs> That's a uh, Agua. One of those giant uh, turtles there, see him? You might, you might spawn there all the time, not sure, but that looks like a perfect spot for him. Let's leave him alone. <laughs> so those guys are tanks. As most of us know, they absorb a lot of uh, bullets, ammunition, of all different types. Okay, so we have something coming up here. Old Primora Mine. Nice, right here. Nice. Blowing rat stag. Couple of them. Call this disciple down there. Let's get rid of him. Need his little buddy there next to him. We do the old curve. Spot. Uh, miner's uh, clean miner hat. Okay, that's uh, pretty nice. The mongrel dog meat here. Nice. All right. I don't know what these two are doing, but whatever. Well, let's uh, let's go ahead to check it out. This is so much fun exploring these areas, brand new to an older game. Yeah, does that say abandoned mine? Keep out. Okay, uh, kind of keep an eye out for our traps. 
Altus are a big fan of those punji boards there. I can interact with that guy. Yeah, that's weird. Sure, lock and loaded. Danger. I don't know why that would be. Someone's shooting at me from somewhere. I still have minecart. Can't interact with them. What is the deal with that? The fuel. A short flame in there, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I don't know who that person is. Cultist Prison Key. Okay. Interesting. Let's uh leave that there. Cultist Prison Key. A note here, Mothman Sermon. Okay. At least we know where that's at. Oh, he might be upstairs here. That's probably where he's coming from. saying that is so weird we can't interact with some of them that is odd just here for the alien blaster rounds that's all i want and maybe the odd stem pack another flamer could be the one that's still downstairs that we're detecting uh all kinds of uh looks like there's all kinds of coal coal veins here so that's pretty good okay coal veins is sometimes not very often, we will get the odd daily where we have to mine coal. Maybe once or twice a year, but a uh, pretty good spot for some coal veins. That's pretty awesome. These cultists are fairly, uh, fairly easy to kill. How big is this place? <laughs> okay. Abandon hope. Thing in this one big giant circle. Some machine gun.
Prisoner door. Elsa. Prisoner's note. Alright, Blood Eagle looks like. Uh, so we won't pick that up because it might have something to do with a quest. Okay, interesting. Oh. First of all, we got a hunter here. Yeah, that's not, uh, that's not fun at all. The skeleton's in here with a shovel. Oh. Oh, wow. That's pretty gruesome. Yep. It sure is. I'm surprised we'd get in here without that key. Oh, well. This is uh, fairly large. There's gonna definitely uh, get lost in here. Oh, we came that way, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Oh, we're going to the right spot. Then. Just want to make sure we're going to the right look. Oh, prisoner door. Hear that. Oh my lord. Oh flamer boy. Well, this is quite something here. Huh. Can interact with these guys for some reason. Stuff. We drop that. We need that. This is a little lair. Awesome. Huh. It's quite the little journey here. Blood trough. See that? Nah. Uh, that's weird. That's all cornered off there. I don't think there's any way anywhere else to go here, is there? Oh, it's this prison door. Okay. Huh. Interesting. That's cool. prison door. See if we can go back out. I don't think. I think we've pretty much covered everything. Everything here. Or I think we did anyway. If I can get up here, there we go. I don't think I made it on this side. I don't think there's much over here. They've definitely outdone themselves with uh, these areas. Definitely new kind of themes. You know, it's not like the, you know, the same old stuff like this little kind of shelf made out of concrete blocks and all that. Like, 
just something like that in these type of books right usually they're all burnt books and stuff but uh, that's interesting just like little notes little stuff like that i've been noticing about skyline valley area i think that's pretty much it for the most part yeah cool Out of the way. <laughs> that was interesting. Huh. Right there, old, uh, more on mine. Okay. Good stuff. Now, uh, let's keep going here. Let's keep going. Get pretty close to, uh, the hour. We'll just keep going a little bit more. these rad stakes we gotta be careful of because the glowing ones will attack you something similar to the uh albino ones they'll come after you too little beaver there Uh, glowing death claw. Yeah, and there don't come across those very often either. Did you throw something at me? I think you did. Jim, holy mackerel. Yeah, this guy means business, doesn't he? Hey. Almost died there. <laughs> There's someone else down here. Doesn't look like it. Glowing death claw right here, so I don't know if that's a a spawn point for those guys, but it'd be nice to have another spawn point for the for the old death claws for sure. We got something looks like we got a mill of some sort popping up. This is so cool. We got something coming up here. Oh well. Wow. Yeah, the old lightning strikes, they like to land on you. Alright, little unmarked location here, looks like, guys. Deadly uh, glowing ant. All these ants around that is so nuts. I don't think we have any of the grenades on, we do we? No, we don't. Got him. 
We only have a couple more. There's a pair of gutsies over there. Oh, is that but? I took care of some of the ants. Yeah, this is a good little ant farm here. If these guys spawn here all the time, is that's where we were up on that hill when we were um, heading this way. And uh, this is where the ants were when we looked down. I said, oh, we'll just leave those guys alone. There's some liberators somewhere. I don't know where they are. I'll drop here. Oh, wow. What is going on? Look at all the liberators up there. <laughs> A little area to get some XP, I guess. I'm thinking this is a random encounter area where enemies fight other enemies. I just happened to get here before the Liberators did. Yeah, he's usually uh, in those type of these type of instances on the map. What will happen is uh, different types of enemies will, enemies will come together and they'll just fight each other. And uh, Welsh is a good spot that that happens, for example. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Alright, that's pretty awesome. Good to know, right? Good to know the stuff. So I'm thinking there's other enemies that, that may spawn here, you know, that might come across uh, super mutants or scorched or whatever, but we, it's too early to tell what it's going to be. Got some cash registers here. Let's check inside. Some sugar, we got a chef hat. Some more sugar, purified water, some cream. Drink the cream. More sugar. It's tough. <laughs> have a hiker. Zero requirement lock. Great Mentats, it's good, Let's grab those. So good to have. Yeah, that's pretty cool, guys. Glad we came down here. Coca Cola. We got some more stuff in here. The skill three lock. All kinds of goodies in there. Look at that imitation seafood. Nice. Cajun beans. Nice. All right, that's cool, guys. That is cool. Uh, so we're pretty much there at the hour there now. And again, this is an unmarked uh, location right here in the map. And uh, so basically, uh, yeah, could be just a random encounter. Enemies fight other enemies, what I'm thinking of. It could be different enemies every time. What we'll do is we'll pop back here in the next episode and we'll finish this off. I'm thinking just one more episode we'll do, depending on how busy we get going through here. Um, I think there's maybe a couple other things we have to explore, but, uh, but yeah, I don't know how we didn't explore this. Maybe we just kind of bypassed it, but we'll see what happens. We're now in rush. Um, there is a lot to cover with a big update that we just had. With a huge map expansion with 
things that's going on. So definitely take it day by day and uh, and all that. So yeah, rock and roll. Got a nice little area down here. Um, other than like, you know the usual storm that's above us. And you know, so we can actually see what we're doing and all that jazz. So pretty awesome. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and share when you have the chance. It really helps me out. I'd like to thank my channel members, Artistically Arranged, Boogaloo Bronson, Michael Edwards, Nigel Whiffin, Heather, White Tribe Star, and 138 Robco. Thank you all so very much, and I hope you all have a nice day.